in light of that, like you said, you know, you want to put out something that makes you feel good and, um, you know, you, you, you feel that. So then where, where's the line between, um, man, I want to stand on people. I want, I want them mm-hmm. to see what I put on mm-hmm. as the kids say, you know, cause I have this, yeah. <clears throat> I think because of the, um, <laughs> the whole sneaker or preachers thing, yeah. you know, Sometimes I don't like wearing my nice shoes to go preach mm-hmm. because of that mentality for some people. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's like it's 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 become like a little conviction. So I'm like, okay, I'm just gonna put on some some shoes, even yeah. I would want to wear something else. Yeah. Um, I don't want someone to think, oh, he just came to show off because yeah. of being on a platform, for example. So where where is that kind of line, that balance? Yeah, you know, kind of have. <clears throat> I think there's a there's a certain like conviction that comes with it, like you're saying. Like there's mm-hmm. a because ultimately when you're in these spaces, say as a as a speaker, as a preacher, um, what is bringing what what is is what you're wearing bringing attention to the Lord, or is it bringing attention to something else? You know. Mm-hmm. But yeah, I would say it. I think it it just deals with with the conviction of the Lord that you may have with Him. Mm-hmm. Like um, He may tell you, hey, not not worry that. Mm-hmm. Like it's okay. Yeah, but some, some would say <laughs> he would tell them <laughs> to wear it, you know? Um, and I just think it's just what brings God glory. I feel like you looking the best at times can bring glory to the Lord, mm-hmm. you know? Um, not for your sake, but uh, you're, you're a son of God. Like, mm-hmm. um, you get the ability um, to present yourself, and I think that it reflects the Lord. I honestly do, but yeah, I get that because I preach sneakers. Like, there's there's this thing about it. I'm like, oh man, like, why does that become a thing? Yeah, yeah, because yeah, it yeah. is a thing, you know. Yeah. But then it takes people like, oh man, all preachers are wearing nice sneakers. I mean, right, they can make a lot of money right, and da 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 da. And I'm like, some have the ability to afford those sneakers, right. and it's okay. Mm-hmm. Um, and it's not the sole purpose of why they're doing it, you know. For some, it might be. I don't know, but that fruit will be revealed. But um, hey, just let mm. it be. Yeah, because like one thing could be. Does the clothes that you're wearing have an opportunity for you to like tie in a story with it Mm -hmm. to like give glory to the Lord and have a testimony? And so like, for example, maybe Jalen bought this shirt in Puerto Rico while while he was down there and Mm -hmm. it was a nice shirt. And he's just like, no, like whenever people ask me about the shirt, I can share about like my trip to to Puerto Rico and like what like the Lord showed me in that and just like an avenue to be able to like connect with people. And even yeah. And even the point of like, um, if the Lord asks you to give it up, why are you willing to give it up? Mm. Like if he's, if he asks you to give those shoes away, why are you willing to give it up? And th- that question is like, what has yes. your heart? Because, mm. uh, <laughs> that's no, funny. I know got a story about that with shoes. <laughs> Not with the watches. With the watches. Yeah. I, no, there is yeah. usually I'm every time yeah. I feel like there is, when it comes to people who, who have an eye for style or mm-hmm. the, it, okay, I'm just going to say this. It's a God given skill. Like, we, we attribute singing as a God-given skill. We attribute um, wealth building business as a God-given skill, preaching as a God-given skill. When you think about Exodus, when he talks about those people who are literally giving the skill to build the temple and many different other skills, it's a God-given skill, mm-hmm. being able to dress, being able to um, create clothing, being able to do that. It's a God-given skill. Mm-hmm. Um, and so there are some people who have a God-given skill that there are times where the Lord will ask them to give away certain pieces of clothing. Mm-hmm. Um, I know I have a friend who is good at it. The Lord keeps asking him to give away jackets. <laughs> Mm. And I'm like, and I'm one of them. Like, I'm like, I just got this new jacket. I said, Lord, can I please keep this one? <laughs> that was, I was an honest yeah, yeah, yeah. question, you yeah. know? Because, like, I know somebody who, like, who loves shoes, and the Lord keeps asking him to, like, give shoes away. Mm. And I know pastors who, I know a pastor who, like, who gets them. Like, and it's, like, these testimonies, testimonies. Okay, okay. I, I, I know yeah, what you mean. I remember yeah, what I remember. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So did it hit you? What, what it did, it did. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Makes sense. Yeah. 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 But I feel like, I feel like, yeah, that's, it depends. Like, you, you, are you willing to give it up if he asks you mm. to give it up? That's such a good thing. Hmm. 